it's a week. We recorded it all in one session, which you probably realised as well. So we, we, yeah, we don't wear the same clothes for a week. <laughs> Ooh, <but> skanky. <laughs> but minging. Twas minging. Um, that's very English, isn't it? Minging. Minging. Don't like that word. It's horrible. It's mm. meant to be horrible. But we've, we've split it up into the days, and yeah. this, is, this is the summary of the week, but also... To be honest, Tuesday. To be honest, Tuesday. And you've got a cracker of a <laughs> quote for to, to, to be honest. <laughs> to be honest. To be honest. On this Tuesday. You have got a cracker of a quote, haven't you? I have. I like this one. And it goes, Sometimes I wake up in the morning and I think I must be a nicer person. Then I just laugh and carry on with my day. <laughs> I had, I used to do a lot of work for the Industrial Society, which is a magnificent organisation. It doesn't even exist in the same way anymore. That's when I first saw that great quote that, who are we to play our lives in, at a low level? You know, life expects you to be great. Oh, yeah, yeah. We'll use yep. that next week, that'd be a good one. Mm -hmm. And there was this lady who was so about equality, women's rights, politically correct, magnificent campaigner and I'd said something in passing and she said oh masturbation makes you deaf and I went what <laughs> and she knew she'd had me she said there's three things you want to watch out I must I ought masturbation yeah um even the crow thought it was funny <laughs> should ought must mm -hmm. yeah and there's there's a should ought must there isn't there sometimes I wake up and wish I could be a nicer person this mm -hmm. pressure Yep. to change, then I just laugh and carry on with my day. <laughs> it's that acceptance of oneself, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it is. It is. And, and again, it goes back um, to what we were talking about before, about being beautiful. Um, and strange. And strange. And it is. It's all about self-acceptance. And I know that on the whole, I, I'm a nice person. Um, I don't feel the need to be any nicer. Sometimes there are times that I think I need to be nicer. I'm loving this. But then I do just laugh and I carry on with my day. I do feel the need to be any nicer. No. That's Downton Abbey stuff, that is, <laughs> isn't it? The dowager. <laughs> I have no need to be any nicer. No, because I think I am nice. It's like the T-shirt. I know I, I can be kind to one person today. Today's not looking good for you. Not looking Tomorrow good for either. You. <laughs> yeah. Actually, some of my drivers used to say that about me. Is this a good day to come in the office? Are you feeling like being like, nope? Mm. And they would, they would go away. <laughs> well, that's respect, isn't it? Yeah. So we hope you enjoyed the week. Let's give you a little reminder of where we've done. We recorded on Monday, and that gets our week off to a great start. Because mm -hmm. you might have seen us giggling. I find this lady quite funny in a professional sense. So we started with Pooh's Difficult Day, which had a great impact on LinkedIn the week before that, didn't it? And then uh, Maya Angelou's, I've learned that people will remember how you make them feel. Mm -hmm. So our mission is to make people, if that was just your mission in life, to make other people feel good. Mm -hmm. Be great. It'd be great, wouldn't it? And then we had the serious version of Roger Kipling's If. And which your, is beautiful. And Absolutely your punchline, which was hilarious. Give them that one again, in case they missed it. If you can keep your head whilst all about you are losing theirs, you really don't understand the problem. <laughs> I think that is deeply profound for our current situation and we haven't mentioned the C word and we're not. Then we had Alice in Wonderland. Mm -hmm. Then we'll do red pill, blue pill next week. <laughs> I like that. Gandhi, learning and living. Mm -hmm. It's a bit like Jesus. Jesus is coming, look busy. <laughs> <laughs> or in bus driver speak, the boss is coming, look busy. busy. Yeah, fake it. And there's no beauty without some strangers. I love that. And then... Uh, Sometimes I wake up and wish I could be a nicer person. And then I just laugh and carry on with my day. That's the way we should do it, we should do it. Right, that's the message then. Mm -hmm. And if anybody has got any quotes, we'd love to hear them. Funny, sensible. And get some guests. That'd be fantastic. Kendall? Yep. Paula? Paula. Give them their full names. We could ask Jamie. Yeah, Jamie Forster, Kendall Heron, Paula... Thompson. Thompson. Lee Thomas might be quite funny. Oh, my goodness, that man is so funny. Get Chuck Norris on. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure we can think of one or two Chuck Norris quotes. Oh, I've got to do the video for that. <laughs> 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 on that Chuck chuckle, I think we should say goodbye. And it's goodbye from Lex. 
That is goodbye from Sandy. AKA hinge and bracket. Would you dare to do that? Would you dare us to do that? Hinge and bracket. Not this week. Not this week. I have to get the costume. Yep. It's got to be in full costume. And I have to get the wine. Yes. And get sloshed. <laughs> this is a professional little bit on well being, isn't it? Yes. So let's be professional. Yeah. <laughs> But as a little side note, for me personally, and I'm not recommending this to anybody, but wine does help well-being. Oh, do you have a wine of choice? Um, it's getting chilly now, so I'm back on the red. Yes, you change with the seasons, <laughs> don't you? Yes, yes. David Sachs, if you've not come across him yet, we'll do a, it's like a sponsored buy, isn't it? Uh, David Sachs, who did um, Maison Sachs, mm -hmm. very posh restaurant, and a couple of other ones as well. He's, he's doing his own deliveries in the local area now of restaurant quality wine at high street prices. Mm. <gasps> David Sachs, you should be sponsoring this show. Yeah. Gotta go now. Googling. <laughs>